Well, hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Trail Guides here on The Head Angle. And in this week's episode, we're joined by John Bettridge who shows us how to repeatedly miss turns and none other than GT Marvel's classic Cy Payton who shows us how to case as we check out Kimber Freeride Park. Kinver Bike Park is a fantastic hidden little gem just north of Kidderminster in the West Midlands. If you want more details about how to get there, the full address and postcode will be in the description as always. The first thing you notice when you come to Kinver are the jumps and they are quite big, but don't worry, there is something for everyone with smaller jumps for less able riders. And if jumps aren't your thing, there is single track, steep and technical little sections too. So there's a little bit for everybody. So without further ado, let's check it out. After riding for a short while we came across this jump. It wasn't a big jump by any stretch of the imagination but it was seemingly quite technically difficult. None of us could seem to hit it perfect or how we wanted to. Come up here, you're going to get your foot as high up here as you can and get to here. I mean, admit, but it is it's the smallest jump here or one of the smallest jumps but the most technical and just shows you that you don't have to send it big to improve on your technique. You could spend half an hour on this and still not get it perfect. Yes. You know, you could always get it better. Um, As the uh, BC coaches would say, this is an example of slow in, fast out. Oh, 100%. So, the guideline is, is you do come in real fast. Yeah. And you've got two things to worry about is the speed bump, that can throw you, and those roots. So, you want to come high here, break in the straight. Go up into the berm, but do all your braking there. So as soon as you get to here, high up as you can. But always with Kimfer, it's, it's very dry and dusty. Yeah, better in the winter. It's Definitely. better when it rains. Definitely. <laughs> Keep it high. Tendency is to drop down, but you want to try and take off about high up here as you can, because it's more of a it's yeah. more of a step down, so it's easier to clear. Shorter distance, higher point. But then try and flick it out. In the wet, you can land it on the inside. You can come inside, inside, which is real nice. But nah. the, I don't know if that's on today, because this nah. inside here is probably deep. Too, is, yeah, look how deep that is. Cool. Now you've talked the talk, let's see if we can walk the walk. Walk the walk. Case. I clearly got schooled by John and Cy there. Anyway, after this, we were joined by Paul Aston and Cy took us over to another part of the wood where we checked out some of the single track.
That was amazing to ride, but there was a couple of line choices John wanted to go back and have a look at. Steep section here, safe bet is the outside line, but the inside line across these roots and these boulders, these rocks, jumping across, opens up this corner massively as Mr. Bettridge is about to demonstrate. And that guys and girls hopefully gives you an idea of what Kimber is all about. I had an absolutely great day's riding, good to catch up with some old buddies and ride with them. Definitely go give Kimber a try, I can highly recommend it. And as always, if you like these videos, give them a big thumbs up, like and subscribe and do all that jazz. This is part of a much larger series, so if you are looking at different places to ride, go check out our trail guides in our playlist. And until next time guys, see you later, bye.